Hi, my name is Barbara, and I'll be hiking the PCT in 2022. So, for all my friends and family who don't know, the Pacific Crest Trail is a trail that goes all the way from Mex the Mexican border all the way to Canada. And uh, I'll be hiking a section of it. I'll be hiking from the Mexican border all the way to South Lake Tahoe. Um, and this is my handy dandy Pacific Crest Trail map here. I'll be hiking from down here, <laughs> Mexican border. Uh, it's, the city itself is called Campo. And then up through here, around and around, through the desert, through the Sierra Nevada, all the way up to South Lake Tahoe here. Um, and my start date is March 28th. There's a whole permit process and everything with that. And with that, you get a specific start date. And my specific start date is March 28th. I'll be flying to San Diego on March 26th. And I'll be hiking until July 6th uh, when I have a flight home um, planned for that. My full-time job after college is going to start on July 11th. And I needed a few days to at least get settled in some new place before uh, I start my new job. So that's really the reasoning for that um, specific date to return. Um, I was really hoping to hike the whole trail, um, which is a little bit crazy and unrealistic, but that was my goal. Um, however, uh, this is my dream to have this, this job. Um, and so, uh, I'm not going to let that go, and I'm going to still hike part of it, the trail, and still get to do my job in July, which is really exciting. So yeah, um, I'll be hiking through California only, um, but the whole trail goes through California, Oregon, and Washington. Um, I'll be carrying everything I need on my back uh, in a backpacking backpack. Um, mine is the Osprey Lumina. Um, I'll go through all of the gear that I'm going to bring um, in another video, but uh, basically I'll have all of my food in my pack and I'll have to filter water as I go um, and stop and resupply towns to get more food. Uh, my, my resupply route has been planned um, through some sort of, uh, it's called Craig's Online PCT Planner that helps people out in planning their trip. And um, I'll be stopping about every more like five to seven days um, to get more food at these resupply towns at like grocery stores and through stuff that I send myself in the mail. And then um, just throughout those weeks, the time that I don't have the resupply food, um, I'll be using the food that I got at each stop. And I'll be filtering my water um, and all those things. Uh, and I'll be sleeping in a tent. Um, I bought the Gossamer Gear The One, is what it's called. And it is a trekking pole tent, so it'll be held up by my trekking poles, the ones that I'm holding while I'm walking, and uh, some stakes in the ground. And it's really lightweight, um, which is why I picked it, and still really affordable. Um, and I did a lot of research on freestanding versus trekking pole tents, and that's what I decided. Um, I'll also be carrying a satellite phone for safety reasons. It has GPS navigation on it, and I'll also have navigation on my phone um, through this app called uh, Far Out. Uh, that used to be called Gut Hook, which um, has maps of the Pacific Crest Trail, and people update it all the time, giving information about um, where the water sources are and all things like that, um, and if there's any trail closures or any weather problems. And um, so I'll be carrying uh, my phone doing that kind of thing on the Far Out app, and also using um, my satellite phone. It's the Garmin InReach Explorer. And I'll be able to text my parents and um, let them know I'm safe and it'll, it'll track me throughout my entire hike. And I'll be charging that with my power bank, let's say with my phone, um, throughout my hike. And then I'll recharge everything during my resupplies. Um, that's pretty much all the things I had to say about the hike. I'm really excited. Clearly I've got my map up on my wall and I've been planning this. Um, I first became a pipe dream back about a year ago, um, and I wanted something to do after I graduated that um, was an adventure of a lifetime, and this is what I decided was going to be it.
Uh, and I'm really excited to share that with you guys. So thanks for watching.